no. All right, Bob. Thank. I mean, we didn't even say it yet. I said I the know, same I thing when it. I saw it in the rundown. I'm like, you got to be kidding me. You probably thought we were done talking about them, but not yet. The brood ten cicadas, they are back. But this time, the experience will be much different. They better now, be. yeah, the cicada, oh, aren't they lovely? Eggs that were laid back in May and June are hatching. And that means that the tiny cicada nymphs are finding their way into the ground where they will stay until about 2038. They're simply going to bounce off you and hopefully land on the ground underneath the tree or where you're standing, dig down into the soil and find the roots of plants to attach and begin feeding for the next 17 years. All right, here's the good news. Michael Rapp says most people probably won't even notice the baby cicadas, which are only a couple of millimeters long. But if you want to try and see them, he says put a black piece of paper under an oak tree with brown wilting branches, and then you got to wait it out. Okay, the idea is the black paper will make the cicadas easier to see when they eventually come in for a landing. But to quote him, they're simply going to bounce off of me. Listen, <laughs> you, you try that and let me know how you make out. Okay? I'm wearing a hat for the next month, that's for <laughs> We're sure. We're good.